Damon put Eunice, Mabel, and get set. I'll be back at the end to see if you can grable out the theme. <laughs>to do yet, Bimo? Yeah, I'm bored. Not yet. Huh. Dance buddy! Hey, that's the record mom and dad used to play for me when I couldn't sleep. Don't break it! Ow! Nice going, Bimo. You wrecked the record player. Where all this stuff come from? My tree hole. Huh? You know how you got that place in your head where you keep all that mind stuff you don't want to deal with? My vault. Yep. Well, I got a bunch of stuff too. Only it's real stuff. But I still don't want to deal with it. So, I just jam it in my tree hole. Sure is a lot of stuff. Yeah, I like stuff. I just don't like putting it away. <laughs> Ow! Hey, what's this? That's something that used to belong to mom and dad. Like when they used to investigate monsters and stuff. Printed out adventures and missions for them to go on. Cool. Think it still works? Nah, I don't think so. It's pretty old. Bimo made the old monster machine go. Yay, Bimo! Whoa, check it out. Looks like one of those missions you were talking about. You know what I'm thinking? That I need a bigger tree hole? No, man. We should start using this thing to find adventures to go on, like Mom and Dad. Hey, yeah. Mom and Dad would want that. And you know how much I like police work. Kind of weird this thing just showed up and started working, though. I don't even remember putting it in my tree hole. Psh, whatevs. Weird stuff happens to us all the time. Oh, yeah. So what are we waiting for? Let's get all up in the investigating biz. Finn and Jake investigations. Yeah, boy. Yay! Bimo is an investigator. Um, I don't think you're ready for field work yet, Bimo. You could be our secretary. Yay! Bimo is a secretary. What should I do first, boss? How about cleaning up the office? This place is a mess. And see if you can fix the record player. It's totally jacked up. Can't have a post-investigation dance party if the record player's jacked up. Ugh. Look, there's a new case available on the ticker type. Fable Nable, it's Cooper here again. You Grables are probably new to playable Grables, I reckon. I'll offer you some help from time to time so you don't get your mind labels too confused. <laughs> Would you like some tutorial help from your pal, Cooper? When you get near something important, it gets all sparkly label and a little menu thingy comes up. That means you can do stuff to it. To look at something, press the button on your control device that matches the look icon. Look at every. You'll miss lots of important puzzle clues if you don't. When you get a new case that needs investigating, the ticker type machine will Babel Grable a new print thingy for you to read. When you read the ticker type message, you just have to press the correct button thingy to travel to the start of the new investigation. There's always a Finn and Jake case to go and explore, but there's no hurry. Go ahead and look around your treehouse. There are lots of things to label with and look at. Tick, tick, tick. This is no time to check the time. We don't have the time. Tick, tick, tick. Look, there's a new case available on the ticker type. Our first case. Candy Kingdom on lockdown after citizens vanish. Whoa, Jake! We better get to the Candy Kingdom. It sounds serious. Hmm. Nothing much happening in the Ice Kingdom today. Pee Wee needs our help. We better leave soon. Dude, let it go. Flame Princess just isn't into you.
Is Ice King doing anything creepy today? Why are we messing around? Let's get over there! Our first case! Candy Kingdom on lockdown after citizens vanish. Whoa, Jake! We better get to the Candy Kingdom. It sounds serious. I've got a tutorial thingy for you. You want to see it? Playable Grables are all about exploring. Wherever you are, make sure you check out every corner. You can touch and grab and use things in the world by pressing the interact label control on your input device. All the thingies you pick up go into your inventory. You can put one of them in your hand by opening the inventory and choosing it. When you have something in your hand, you can use it on other things in the world. That includes your stretchy dog friend, Jake. Use him on interact spots to get to hard to reach places like the castle moat. He can do other stuff for you too. It never hurts to experiment with using Jake on things. When you meet people in the world, you should be nice and talk to them. Just walk up and select the speech bubble thingy. I bet Jake could help me out here. Hey, did you see that? We should stop those guys. How come? The princess said keep people out of the castle, not the moat. Oh yeah, I guess you're right. Hey, be careful down there. There's lots of broken glass. And one of the grates on those pipes that lead into the castle is loose and rusty. Broken glass? Somebody should clean this up. Combination ain't working. No way we're getting in through there. If that grate weren't so strong, we could probably break it. You're gonna need something to break it with. I swear, I don't even have a criminal record. Somebody help! Jake, Abraka Daniel's in trouble. We have to help him. Would you like some tutorial help from your pal, Cuber? Playable Grables aren't all about combat, but sometimes you have to fight. Just press your attack button thingy to swing your sword. When you get enough hits without the bad guys hitting you, you can activate special sword powers and Jake battle forms. At the end of the fight, you get treasure for your treasure room at the treehouse. The better you fight, the more treasure you get. Yeah! 
our work here is done. This is about all the treasure we can carry. That's enough, you two. Abracadaniel is under arrest for kidnapping my citizens. No way! Abracadaniel wouldn't hurt a fly! Like, literally. For a wizard? Kinda lame. I'll be in the castle surveillance room if you want to see proof. Meanwhile, Abracadaniel is going to the dungeon. Guards! Take him away! Don't worry, Abracadaniel. This isn't over. Finn and Jake Investigations will totally clear your name! fountain looks so tasty I could just drink it all up. This place should attract flies like nobody's business, but with all the sugar around. The bees are building a hive. Better let them finish. The bees are building a hive. Better let them finish. This might be something Jake can help with. I should drop something in there to scare away the gnomes. The chimney leads into the house, but we can't fit through. That won't work. Maybe we could drop something down the chimney to force them out. Jake could probably help me with this. Nah, I don't think so. This house has been claimed in the name of the gnomes. Go away! They're not going to open the door, but we have to get in. Don't bust up Chet's door. We can find another way in. I don't think so. Hey man, where did PB go? We really need to talk to her. The security room. She's been spending most of her time in there ever since everybody started disappearing. Go on in. See you later. Sure are a lot of banana guards on duty today. That's enough cotton candy to last, like, a year! This room is a crime scene, and I can't let you guys in unless PB says it's okay. That guy's guarding Peppermint Butler's room. Sorry, Finn. If you want to get into the dungeon, you'll have to prove that Abraka Daniel is innocent. I don't think that guy's gonna let us in the dungeon. That's enough cotton candy to last, like, a year! Hey, Finn. Hey, Jake. Sorry, kitchen's off limits. You need to get permission from the princess. Those doors lead to the royal foyer. It's locked. This door goes to the courtyard. Yeah, I'm not 
going back through there. Candy sewage is still sewage. Nail. I probably shouldn't mess with other people's mail. Ever wonder how the houses in the Candy Kingdom don't go stale? That's some yummy looking shrubbery right there. The bees are building a hive. Better let them finish. I'm always ready to help out if you need me. Just saying. The chimney leads into the house, but we can't fit through. I should drop something in there to scare away the gnomes. Maybe we could drop something down the chimney to force them out. Why would I do that? That's not working. I could probably help you out here, you know. You just ask. That ain't working, dude. We said go away! We said go away! You gotta find another way in! That's some yummy looking shrubbery right there! That's enough cotton candy to last, like, a year! Hey Finn! Hey Jake! Well, that door leads into PB's castle. That's the door to the security room. Hey, Banana Guard, what happened in here? I don't know. I was on my snack break when it happened. I was only gone for a minute. When I came back, everything was busted. Do you think whoever broke in got caught on camera? No way, Finn. And even if they did with the equipment broken, there's no way to see. Never seen a Banana Guard before. Wow, PB really looks stressed. Finn and Jake investigations to the rescue. What can we do to help, Princess? Thanks for coming, guys. Sorry I had to arrest your friend. Why did you arrest Africa Daniel? There's no way he's a kidnapper. Sorry, Jake, but the facts don't lie. Facts, huh? What are these so-called facts? Well, someone trashed the cameras so that nothing would be recorded. We also found a note that says Wizards Rule. Abrak Daniel is the only wizard anyone saw in the Candy Kingdom last night. It doesn't take a genius to see that he's the kidnapper. 
Can we talk to Abraka Daniel? I think it's important to hear his side of the story, too. No way. He's being held in the dungeon, and he's going to stay there unless someone can prove him innocent. What'll it take to prove he's innocent? Look for clues and interview people. You can start in Peppermint Butler's room across the hall. He was one of the kidnapped people. I'll be here if you find anything. Chamomile tea. Princess Bubblegum likes to drink this stuff when she's stressed out. Looks like the security monitors won't do us any good. They're totally jacked up. Wizards rule. Only a wizard would write something like that. Sorry, Finn. If you want to get into the dungeon, you'll have to prove that Abraka Daniel is innocent. That's Peppermint Butler's room. I've got a tutorial thingy for you. Do you want to see it? You can pick up a lot of thingies you find while exploring. Pick something up by interacting with it. You should pick up everything you can. You never know if you might need it later. Maybe the kidnappers tracked this in. The kidnappers had to have tracked this in here, Jake. Yeah! Maybe they left a leaf trail. We can follow it and see how they got in and out. There were a bunch of leaves in the hallway earlier, but I swept them up. They led toward the kitchen. Nice. We should go check it out. You won't be able to go anywhere until you solve the mystery, but even then you might run into trouble. The guard inside the kitchen is really strict. Here's my business card. If he stops you when you're in the kitchen, just give it to him and say Banana Guard 182 says it's cool. Sweet. Thanks, BG 182. Somebody spilled jelly beans all over the floor, and onto those pamphlets. Hmm, some kind of circle thingy. I don't think so. Candelabra, nice. Needs candles though. It's one of the Gumball Guardians. I wonder if he saw something. Hey, GG! Did you guys notice anything suspicious on the night of the kidnapping? Well, we saw Abraka Daniel enter the Candy Kingdom, but we didn't think anything of it. Not long after that, I heard a crash and saw him sneak into Peppermint Butler's room through this window. Did you see any other wizards around? No, just Abraka Daniel. Look at this mess. He must have spilled those jelly beans when he broke in. It's Starchy. He probably knows something. Sup? Starchy, do you know anything about the missing candy people? Maybe so. Last night, Starchy was walking the halls, sliding pamphlets for the Veritas Brigade under people's doors. Did you see something? Well, no, but... As I was sliding a pamphlet under Peppermint Butler's door, I heard a struggle inside. Sounded like a kidnapping. You heard Peppermint Butler getting kidnapped, and you didn't help him? Sounds kind of fishy. Now hold on! I wanted to help. I really did. I tried to bust through the door when he called for help, but, well, Starchy's not as young as he used to be. Thanks, Starchy. This has been very helpful. You betcha! I just hope you two can get to the bottom of this mess.
Hey, Ben. Hey, Jake. Sorry, kitchen's off limits. You need to get permission from the princess. Even the kitchen's being guarded? Ben, Jake, how's the investigation going? Did you find anything? Not yet. We're still working on it. Um, okay. Well, come back when you have something to show me. Nope. Those things don't combine. Dude, those things totally don't go together. did exactly nothing. No, I don't think so. Quit messing with that. Investigation going. Did you find anything? I think Jake and I found all the evidence we need to solve the mystery and clear Abraka Daniel's name. Of course! How could I have missed it? Finn, you totally proved that Abraka Daniel is innocent. Um, we did? Of course. Here, let me walk you through it. What fell on the floor while the kidnapping was taking place? Jelly beans. They were all over the place. Yes, but they couldn't have fallen first. Try again. Um, a chair? Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Try again. Starchy's pamphlet. He was sliding it under Peppermint Butler's door when he heard the kidnapping. Yes, exactly. And what item do we know fell on the floor when Abracadaniel entered the room? The jelly beans. They were on top of the pamphlet, so they had to have fallen after the pamphlet was already there. Right. Okay, so the jelly beans were on top of the pamphlet. What does that mean? that Abraka Daniel had to come in after the kidnapping. Otherwise, the jelly beans he knocked over would have been under the pamphlet. Exactly! I'm sorry I doubted you, Finn. Abraka Daniel is free to go. Go down to the dungeon, get the key from the guards, and release him. 
It's important that you stay inside the Candy Kingdom until the crisis is over, though. The Gumball Guardians will zap anybody who tries to leave while we're on lockdown. All right! Awesome! That leads to the dungeon. That must be the guard who has the key. Hey, the princess said you would have the key to the cell. Um, I did, but me and my buddy, he was on the last shift. We were playing catch with the keys, and well, he got stuck on the ledge up there. I get him for you, but I'm kind of new, and I don't start climbing to reach high stuff training until next week. Sorry, Finn. Those are the cell keys. That's a sturdy looking door. Jail does not look like a fun place to be. Finn, Jake, get me out of here! We're gonna need to use the cell key to open the door. That's a sturdy looking door! Thanks for getting me out, Finn. I was really afraid that I'd be rotting in that candy prison forever. No problem, man. It's what we do. We knew you weren't guilty. Yeah, but why were you prowling around the candy cane? It did look kind of shady, but with the missing people and all. I wasn't bothering anybody. All I was doing is looking for my favorite cake plate. I lent it to Peppermint Butler a while ago, but I need it back right away. I heard about a really cool wizard party that's about to happen. It's so cool that a whole delegation of people from the Candy Kingdom were brought in as guests. Delegation of candy people? Dude, those are the people who are missing. And somehow, I don't think they're guests at this so-called party. Sounds like some wizards are up to no good. Oh, I guess I really didn't think this through. Abracadaniel, can you take us to the party? Sure. But not without my cake plate, it's bad manners not to bring something, and I'm not putting my famous rainbow fluff cake on just any cake plate. Fine, where is it? I'm not sure. I tried to find it in Peppermint Butler's room, but the place was a mess. I was gonna try Chet's house too, but I didn't get a chance because of, well, being arrested and all. Okay, we'll start looking there. The faster we find it, the faster we can get out of here and find those people. Dude, don't forget that PB has the kingdom on lockdown. We'll need to find a way out. Oh yeah, I almost forgot about that. Well, as soon as you two find my cake plate and a way to get out of the kingdom, I'll take you to the party. I'll wait for you here. Good luck. Algebraic! Sweet! Doesn't seem safe to have this stuff around food. Hands off the science stuff, dude. Science is not your thing. Soap. Bubbly, bubbly soap. PB stove is nicer than ours. Eggs. That reminds me. Do we still have a chicken? Old pizza. Gross. Making some great soapy water, but it's just going down the drain. A faucet. No sink is complete without one of these. Water. Why would I do that? Would you like some tutorial help from your pal, Cuber? Sometimes you have to put two things together to make something new that can help you grable your way through a puzzling puzzle. You combine thingies on your inventory screen. Just use the add control to put each item in a slot. 
Then press the combine button to turn two old thingies into one new thingy. Not everything can be combined together, but it never hurts to try. Especially when you feel like you're stuck. You can combine items with Jake the same way. Sometimes you need to do this when Jake can't grable something on his own. A plastic bottle. The kidnappers must have dropped it. I'm onto something here, but I don't quite have it figured out. Those things don't work together. That kind of seems right, but I think you're missing a step. Check it out! Candles! that isn't candy or cake. Cookbooks. We should exchange recipes with PB sometime. Refrigerator. Wish we had one of those. Pretty sure this guy won't just let us through. Sorry, fan. We're on lockdown. I can't let you through without official written permission. What's this? Banana Guard 182 says it's cool? Oh, I love that guy. He's awesome. If he says you're cool, who am I to stop you? Wasting water, Finn. Water. <laughs> That's one nice bottle of soapy, bubbly water you made there. <laughs> A faucet. No sink is complete without one of these. The updraft is blowing these leaves up to the hole in the tree up above us. This leaf matches the ones out there. The kidnappers must attract the leaves inside from this balcony. It's not working. <laughs> Looks like most of the bees are asleep. Hmm, that B 
beehive could be useful. Be gentle, Jake. You don't want to wake up the bees. Hey, gnomes! I got something for you! Did this? Prepare to defend yourselves. Much better than that. Ooh, it's a note from Peppermint Butler. The note has a picture of a candle holder and says something about a secret room. What secret room? A book of matches. Those things can't be combined. What a mess! looks so tasty I could just drink it all up Peppermint Butler's room. Huh, secret room. That's not at all creepy. Uh, Chet? What's going on? He's too stunned to talk, man. My investigative mind has figured out what happened. Obviously, Peppermint Butler was kidnapped from this room. And whoever it was didn't care about Chet. So, what were Chet and Peppermint Butler even doing in this creepy room? I don't know, man. They're candy people. I don't get candy people sometimes. Yeah, I know what you mean. Well, Chet looks pretty comfortable. I guess we should just leave him here. Let's keep investigating. I don't even want to know why Chet is hanging upside down in this creepy room. This must be Abracadaniel's cake plate!
Weird book. Kinda Enchiridion-ish. Only creepy. My cake plate! Would you mind holding on to it for me? I'm a little weak from doing hard time. Any idea how we can get out of the Candy Kingdom? How should I know? The kidnappers got in and out without using the main gate. Maybe you should figure out how they did it. Where should we look for the cake plate? You should try looking at Chet's house. He borrows stuff from Peppermint Butler all the time. Gotta bounce. Guess he's just gonna wait here while we find his cake plate and a way out of the Candy Kingdom. I think you might be onto something, Finn, but that thingy isn't doing much on its own. Hey! It's one of those bubble blower things! I thought that looked familiar! Nice! With that updraft, this bubble will act just like an elevator. I wonder what PB uses this tree for now that the lich is gone. A magic portal that leads to Wizard City! Dude, we can't leave without Africa, Daniel! We've got your cake plate, and we know how to get out of here. You ready? Yes! Party time! Um, he knows it's not a party, right? Shh! Don't tell him! Look, he's so excited just to be included. Wizard City, here we come! Here we are, Wizard City. First thing we should do is go to that Ron James guy's shop. He might be able to. Abracadaniel, you are guilty of sharing wizard secrets. No, wait, I... Uh... Wizards only, fools. Uh-oh.
check out all the dosh we got. <laughs> yeah, we kicked some serious booty. Would you like some tutorial help from your pal, Cuber? Sometimes you have to put two things together to make something new that can help you grable your way through a puzzling to puzzle. You can combine items with Jake the same way. Sometimes you need to do this when Jake can't grable something on his own. They've changed Abraka Daniel into a stick or a wand or something. Yoink! Good thinking! I can use Stick Abraka Daniel to crank the crank! There's gotta be a way to open this gate. 